In today's video, I will show you the shiniest deck you have ever seen in Ghost Unchained. A fully composed diamond deck. 30 out of 30 diamonds. Literally the best deck for flex on your opponent. And which deck to meme to if not my best meme deck? Food Chain. Because trust me guys, there is literally nothing better than spawn giant nature creatures in the diamond shine. And well, thanks to this deck, I went from mythic to gold. Yeah, I'm not saying that in the wrong order. I literally went from mythic to gold. You may actually say that this deck is bad. Well, it is because it was the only way for build a fully diamond deck without using all my bank account. So this deck will have not card like Dagan or Boar, but actually will have card like Blood and Bone, Feral Cat, Joe Bones Cutler and well, it's actually better than a stop right there. So yeah, fun fact, it's not the best deck that you will ever see, but actually, even if I went from mythic to gold, losing the majority of the game, I still gained more from win like three or four game in gold with this deck, instead of winning like six, seven games with a full Metroid deck in mythic. So yeah, you can consider that trolling or maybe even smart, but that will be answered in my next video. So be sure to drop a follow and now instead, let's jump right into the shiniest deck you have ever seen. This is the list, guys, I will not like to you this list is actually pretty bad as you can see i have 47 win rate into this deck it's probably the only deck i have a negative win rate in only way that i was able to build a total diamond deck you can see the price is 20 bucks there yeah it's not really 20 bucks i don't know how much this deck costs but trust me a lot more by the way as you can see this is a food chain nature deck is obviously not an optimized list like my food chain deck video that I made. As you can see, we still have our main piece of combo. So the blade fly, the food chain, and even a lot of like refresh card that will help us to refresh the mana for mana source food chain. And even Zaskia, because Zaskia diamond is actually pretty cheap since there are a lot of Zaskia. And the card is actually pretty essential for finding the double food chain. How to play this deck is pretty easy. You just play like a normal aggro nature, even if this is kind of bad aggro nature. And then you just wait for your piece of combo so bladefly food chain and the refresh mana and you mana surge food chain and use food chain on bladefly for spawn three six mana creature or even eight mana creature or maybe even six if you have two bladefly only thing i want to say actually is that the card that i felt the most luck was the trial begins i think you can make the diamond version around that 100 bucks and actually i really felt the luck of this card so i would at least try to find one so in this way it would be like if you had three bladefly in the deck because i felt that the hardest card to find was always bladefly and actually I lost a lot of game for that. And now let's jump in the most shiny games that you have ever seen. Okay, okay, this seems like a good start. Marsh Walker, Felian and Zaskia. Zaskia make us draw the foot shoe foot chain. We are literally just missing uh Blade Fly. Finally probably a decent start with this deck. <laughs> this deck is actually so tragic guys. But yeah. So Finian was actually one of the best cards when I started to play and now he's literally not played from anyone. That's okay, I can go this and then start to get them going. I mean they can trade it if they want, but we still get the 1-1 uh, guy. This deck is actually so bad just for make it diamond, because it's just so hard to make a full diamond deck. At the same time, it's really really bad. Okay, now if they blight bomb we are in a really bad spot. Yeah, obviously they, they got it, obviously. Not really really bad, but pretty pretty bad though. Oh, I could... I see the play, I see the play. Bam. So we kill that. This will kill one plus. Nice. And then we go even with this guy. Okay, that was a solid turn. Next one we for sure pick Zaskia because the sooner it dies, the better it is for us. And even this is really good for us, so I want even to reach that if possible. Actually, they can reach this that turn, but I think they will take this trade, so they probably can. Their turn though was like crazy good. Blight bomb into Finian into. How did he kill it? Oh, the wick. yeah, fire into. Okay, I expect that. Not happy to see this. Really not happy to see this. As I said, let's get the Zaskia going, let's hope they don't have another Blight Bomb. If they use Perseverance, at least we can draw, and we will draw even the two... the two... food chain now, so... Oh, what? That, that is pretty bad, actually, from them. Like, like, if they pick Blight Bomb, we lose, but if they don't, this trade is just so good that... I don't know. Yeah. I don't understand maybe that. I mean, I guess it buffed enough. I guess it buffed enough. 
Can I even go with this? So in this way I just put it out of and I think even with this there. I can go with this to be honest. For uh, Necro Scepter, but I think it's just better to like I really want my Bayfly and this will get me the Actually I probably should have not even buffed this because I just want this one to die to kill it. See? I mean that, that card is still took its its guys. Now they probably double trade into Marsh, and I mean it's still okay. Now we get the food chain, first of all. We even have some regeneration thing that. Hmm. I don't know about that. I, I don't like that. I really just want play like to be honest. I'll get this. Okay, useful. Although if they if they got uh, the corpse, I can't go really a lot lower. Oh, and next turn they can even have the overseer of shit. So I got to clear the most possible. Ooh. I mean, they actually have two zombies most likely, but yeah. It's too problematic. Super big. Yeah, I guess they just face. Everything is so bad there. Okay, we got our brain fly. Although, I got no refresh mechanic. I think. Yeah, I don't see any refresh mechanic. I don't even know what they want. I don't think it will really reach heaven there anyway. Oh, actually, I, I go with all this, so at least I can use this turn. And uh, next turn I can try to go double food chain to blade flies. But they don't have to die before, so how do we not die? This is there. And this is there. Yeah, I really just don't want to die. So the best way for not to die is kill even that instead of this one, because this one would have spammed another feature and if they got over here, which is push more damage. I think that this was actually the best way. Yeah. No, I forgot to play Og. I didn't mana surge yet. Oh, that was so bad. That was so bad, guys. That literally... Actually, I I could have not. Yeah, I could have not because uh, I had the board full. So I had to suck one into that. Yeah, that was so bad by me. But they go face. So they probably don't have... Oh, let's see... Maybe? I don't know. I just need a... Uh, like we have a lot of refresh mechanic in our deck, I just need one. I'm not asking for a lot. Oh, this, but this is just... Not much. Oh, actually I should have one. Bro, I'm playing just so bad. Okay, I guess. Should I use that before though? Okay. Still decent. Ah. Okay. So I need to mana search that shit. So this turn, I will not forget about that. You play this, beep. That, so I had to manage to do the two thing. Oh, now who the fuck killed the zero one? How do we kill the zero one now? I guess I guess we just summon one. Oh, he will kill it. Nice, thank you. That actually helped me. No, no jokes. Okay. Okay, they didn't need a moonbeam. Anyway. 
Oh, I wish you were something good. Okay, let's go with the first food chain. Let's open into a six mana that can trade into some shit. Oh, that's good. That's really not good. That's really not good. Oh, that's really not good. Oh, that's good. I think it. Just. It's crazy! Just not that! Everything but not that! I don't know, I probably, I probably trolled it, but it's not even a troll, like, it was just 25% chance. It was worth to try. Okay, 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 okay. I will not risk, I think. I think I just go for its damage and choose to go there. I think it's not worth it, like, even because 4 health is, like, not super easy for them to, to deal with. But for Rian? For Rian? 3 there and... 3 there and 0 there? Fucking crazy. Uh, I think I can take this. So if I... Oh no, I have no more food chance. Okay, both of those are pretty scary for them. Let's see, let's see. So if they get the... the if they have the 6 mana board wipe, they obviously win, but they maybe have not. Oh, they slipped shoe creature? Did I lose for that? Let's say. No, who the fuck played that trash? Yeah, I don't know how, how I can deal with all that. This will spawn a lot more, bro. This damage was just so trash. I would walk 500 more. Yeah, if they have corpse, how do I not die? I can't do that. Need to moonbeam. Okay, I need to moonbeam before. So if I get a chance to eat one of those. So now I can go this there. Hmm. I don't even know what I can find there to be honest with you. Let's see if I've got something decent. Not really, not really. 10,000 more. Yeah. That's, oh, now we got fun. That's fucking crazy. That's fucking crazy, guys. Literally everything has got like, like, they have just a good face, GP, corpse, and next one they just GP. 3, yeah, corpse, so. And just because this guy just got, I don't know, not the best division of damage. Although, if they do that, do I win? 20, 28, no, I need to damage more. Oh, don't they corpse? Don't they corpse? Bro, if they don't corpse, I just win, I think. Are you okay? Come on, bro. You can't really miss that. Okay. Did I miss it, little guys? Oh, it's no, no, no way. Because it was 20-28. Yeah, I didn't miss it. Either. Yes! First win with this stretch deck. Let's see, let's see, let's see my, my, my fragments. 349. That's a lot, to be honest. If you compare there, 4 win got me 850. So, 4 win with this would, would get me like 1200, something around that. 
And I mean, there I was even mythic and there I'm diamond. If those were the games, be sure to drop a follow, a like, and even enter in this for the giveaways, and even for don't miss any of my video, like for example the next one about if it's worth or not, shine up your deck. And now go check this video about the next set in Ghost Unchained Dread Awakening, or maybe this one about the best budget magic deck. And I guess, see you to the next video.